Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Good afternoon to all. Uh, thank you, Rick, for the introduction. Yang berbahagia, Datuk Dr. Sri um, Subramaniam, Minister of Health Malaysia. Yang berbahagia, Datuk Dr. Lokman Hakim bin Sulaiman, Deputy Director General, Public Health, Ministry of Health Malaysia. Yang berbahagia, Datuk Suhaimi bin Abdullah, Director General, National Anti-Drug Agency. Uh, Mr. John Peter Cools, Chair, Harm Reduction International. Dr. Rick Lines, Executive Director, Harm Reduction International. Yang berbahagia, Professor Adiba Kamruzaman, Chairman Malaysia AIDS Foundation. Michelle Kajaskin, United Nations Secretary General, Special Envoy on HIV AIDS in Eastern Europe and Central Asia. Mr. Steve Cross, Director Regional Support Team for Asia and the Pacific, UN AIDS. Such a long list I have. Uh, Madame Ruth uh, Dreyfus, Commissioner Global AIDS Commission on Drug Policy. Mr. Anand Grover, Commissioner Global Commissioner, uh, Commissioner Global Commissioner on Drug Policy. Yang berbahagia, Datin Paduka Zaitun, Datu Osman, Yayasan Saimdabi, Governing Council Member. Representatives of Ministry of Health Malaysia, Anti-Drug Agency, Department of Islamic Development Malaysia, National Government Agencies, Cooperating Partners, Distinguished Guests, Ladies and Gentlemen. Assalamu alaikum to all of you. On behalf of my colleagues in the Malaysian AIDS Council, it gives me great pleasure to welcome all of you to the 24th, uh, to the 24th International Harm Reduction Conference in Kuala Lumpur. Selamat datang, especially to all our foreign guests who have traveled far and wide to be with us at this conference. We are deeply honored to be the local partner of this International Harm Reduction Conference. Um, and this is a recognition from the global harm reduction community of our role in the response to the HIV AIDS epidemic in Malaysia, which until now, uh, which was until now uh, driven predominantly by the um, injecting drug users. Indeed, it was harm reduction that uh, stemmed the tide of HIV AIDS in Malaysia with new infections halved in the past decade. And ever since the rollout of harm reduction programs um, 10 years ago, close to 50% of, of, of the population of people who use drugs in Malaysia have now access to clean needles, to methadone, to HIV testing and treatment referrals not to mention the thousands of lives saved and the resulting positive uh, return on investment in health care costs. <laughs> the Malaysian harm reduction... I'm having a bit of problem with the lighting here, actually. The Malaysian harm reduction success, um, success story Speaks, speaks for the quality of the leadership of the key actors in national HIV, harm, uh, HIV responses. The Ministry of Health in particular, in particular was and continues to be responsible in the design, implementation, uh, development and resourcing of harm reduction services. We are indeed honoured to be in the company of the Minister of Health, Malaysia. Thank you, Dato, Dr. Subramaniam, for taking the time off from your busy set schedule to address the conference. I would also like, uh, I would also like to take this opportunity, Yang Burhumat, to congratulate you on your appointment as Vice President of the World Health Assembly, of the 69th World Health Assembly, 2006 in Geneva next year, 
And I hear it was a unanimous election. So congratulations to you and also to Malaysia. We look forward to your leadership and as, we, as Malaysia pursues a bigger goal in the global health arena. Congratulations to Yang Berhormat too for winning the Vice President of MIC Anopos. So you have a double victory today, uh, Sri. Uh, Ladies and gentlemen, gentlemen, while leadership is undeniably uh, the impetus for change, the harm reduction movement would not be where it is today without the dedication, commitment, passion, courage, drive, and resilience of the people behind the scenes. On that note, the Malaysian AIDS Council wishes to acknowledge and commend our partner organizations whose work on the ground has directly impacted the lives of thousands of, of uh, people and have effectively changed the course of HIV AIDS epidemic. Our harm reduction is also founded on smart partnerships. Allow me now to thank our local partners and stakeholders for your kind support to this conference. Ministry of Health Malaysia, Minis uh, Malaysian Convention and Exhibi Exhibition Bureau, or MICEP, Yayasan Saim Dabi, Department of Islamic Development Malaysia, or JAKIM, Royal Malaysia Police, National Anti-Drug Agency, Ministry of Foreign Affairs, Malaysia Airports Berhad, Immigration, Department of Malaysia, Royal Malaysian Customs Department, Center of Excellence for Research in AIDS, Austria, the Malaysian Welfare Association of Recovering Drug Users, Iklas, Indivio, and many more. Not forgetting, of course, the Royal Julan Hotel, who has been very helpful to us. We have an exciting conference ahead for the next few days. We hope you will enjoy the conference and enjoy your stay in Kuala Lumpur. Thank you.